There are a number of options available to you regarding searching, filtering and sorting videos when you're in My Content and Videos. When I'm in My Content Videos, I have these options here. If I want to, for example, sort my videos, I have four options. I can sort it by likes, so the video with the most likes is at the top. This one has the most likes, one. If I was to sort by views, then the video with the most views would appear at the top. This one, two views. So we can sort our list of videos by four options. We can also go into state and say, look, show me all the ones that are currently in a state of draft. And there's one video in the state of draft that I haven't published yet. Or I can ask to view those videos that have been published. And here they are here. So we've also got a state option to filter our videos list. But we also can filter our videos list by privacy. Currently I'm seeing all the videos, but if I want to see just those videos that have limited access, then I would choose limited. If I wanted to see those videos that were seen company wide, then I'd choose company. So we can filter our video list by privacy and by state. And we can sort our video list by one of four options. And then also we can search for videos. Perhaps I'm looking for a video that talks about libraries. So I type libraries and press enter. And there are three videos that talk about libraries. Those that are currently published are actually showing me at 2 minutes and 28 seconds there is a mention of the word library. In this video at 38 seconds there's a mention of the word library. So you can search for videos with certain words mentioned in the video. And I can clear the search by hitting the X. If you want to get the video list back to as it was, go to Home and then go to My Content and Videos. And that's the way I find it's quickest to get it back to how it was. Now we can also publish videos by hitting this Publish button. So I'm going to click that. And now this video is published. I can see by this symbol here that it's got limited view, whereas this one is company wide. It has a green symbol. If you wish to edit a video, you can simply go into this pencil and you can edit a video. So I'm going to call it video 11. And you can add a description, etc. I've given it a name, I've given it a description, and I've told it that the language is English. Here are some pictures and I can choose which picture I want as a thumbnail. So I'm going to choose this picture here. I can allow everyone in the company to see it, but at the moment I'm only allowing these two people to see it. And I'm going to click apply. So it's quite easy to actually edit the details about a particular video. We can also go into these actions and delete a video, download a video and share a video if necessary. Now when we're on the home page, we saw that we have this slideshow at the top. And this slideshow is spotlighting certain videos, video 1, and it's just moved automatically to video 2. If you want to spotlight a video, it's quite easy to just go into the gear button, go into admin settings, and on the left hand side, you'll see the option Spotlight Videos. Here it is here. We currently have two videos in our Spotlight, but we can add a video by clicking this option here. I'm then going to search for a particular video. And I'll choose the video from this list. So I'm going to go for video, actually I might go for video 3. And I'll click Save. If I wanted to, I could also rearrange the order of those videos that are spotlighted. And I could also hit the X to delete any video from the spotlight. But I currently have three spotlight videos and I'm going to add a fourth. And I'll go for video 11. And Save. And now I've reached the maximum number of videos. Please remove another one before adding. If I go to the Home tab, I can see here that I've got Video 1, and as I move forward, Video 2, and as I move forward, Video 3. And there's a thumbnail there. So that's called Spotlighting, and you can spotlight a video. But sometimes we want to spotlight a video 
um, just within a certain group. So I'm going to go to a specific group. I'll go to my content and I'll go to groups. And the group that I'm interested in is in a private group. So I might go to Northwind Traders. So I'll click this group here. What we then have is a little gear button here called More Actions. And if I click it, I can manage the spotlight videos for this particular group. So if you need to set up some spotlight videos in the slideshow for a specific group, click this option and then just add those videos.